Do you want to drive a really cool tank? Hi, everybody. Welcome to Atlantis Square Pantis. We start things off, as all the best stories do, with an ice cream tank rampage. Guide Plankton in this tank that he, uh, borrowed through Atlantis, starting in the armory and then escaping into the gardens. You'll need to steer the tank and fire the ice cream cannon to splat the Atlantean defenses and destroy the buildings in your way. Is Plankton finally going to get his wish for world domination? Will he use the tank to get the Krabby Patty recipe? And will the Atlantean gardeners forgive him for getting tank tracks all over the grass? Let's find out! Tank Commander Plankton, reporting for destruction duty! <laughs> Glad I took that tank driving electric in college. It's locked here, but not if I blow it up. <laughs> Tank's even bigger than mine! Not fair! I'm sorely tempted to hit those. Only three more buttons. One to go. Hello, 
door's only gonna open if I hit all the buttons. Sayonara, baby! I'm like a modern day plankinator! Am I bad for doing this? You bet I am! Congratulations to my maniacal genius! Indestructible, I make shellfish look so. Ready to go. Just two buttons left. One to go. I did it! Of course. I'm scared! How did we get into this mess? SpongeBob? Oh, it's easy. I got this new high-tech bubble soap. <sighs> mm. 
SpongeBob? Oh, no, 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 Patrick. This bubble's gonna break all records. <gasps> well, I hope it doesn't break until we get a little closer to the ground. Huh? What have I done? Ah! Ah! <laughs> Hi, gang. In this level, Patrick and I explore the caves under Bikini Bottom. In this level, you can make Patrick and I run around, and you can switch between us at any time. I can use Spat, by trusty spatula, to flip open doors and flip cannons, or to move blocks out of the way. Patrick can use his strength to pick me up and throw me across the level, and he can throw anchors around, too. Hey, the bubble has carried us to a strange and also wondrous cave. Cave? Oh, uh... I was hoping the bubble would carry us to a sandwich shop. Hmm, a seemingly bottomless chasm. Oh. Looks like I'll need my trusty... Right, throw me across the gap, and I'll be able to pull you across after me with this rope. Someone catch you! Okay, SpongeBob. Hey, it's a good thing that we brought Mr. Ropey along today. Hey, thank goodness we didn't bring Mr. Lead waiting along instead. Is that a throw or a chuck? Look out below! And or ahead! Fly! Be free! Is that a throw or a chuck? Your turn, Patrick! And... <laughs> huh? These caves need to be explored! Whoa! I better be careful I don't fall off the edges, though. Uh-oh. Ghostly pirates! Ooh, ghostly pirates! Or are they piratey ghosts? What? A little bit of Sandy's... Whoa, Karate sure would come in handy right about now. Or Squidward's clarinet. Oh. Better hurry! Have a great time, Patrick! Patrick, ready! Patrick, ready! Huh? It's away! SpongeBob is ready! SpongeBob is ready! Look out below! And or ahead! Ahoy there! I have the and I pull back like so! <laughs> you said until we find the exit. Hey, Patrick, your turn. Where's the ground? Patrick, ready. Hey, where'd SpongeBob go? 
I better find him. What's this big cannon shape thing? Here we go! Wow, great! I wonder who left all these cannons here? Hey buddy, wait there and I'll come to you. Patrick reporting. Wow, great! Uh, SpongeBob, I think I'm stuck. Could you come and find me, please? This cannon's facing the wrong way. If I stand in front of it, then it quits pulling it with the spatula she fixed that. I think I'm about to be fired. Ah! Hi, Patrick. What have you been up to? Hey, it's SpongeBob! There you are! Good thing I'm freakishly strong! Your turn, SpongeBob! I think I got to lift this cannon over. Wondrous treasures we'll find in these caves. Well, you're right. And maybe we'll find lunch or dinner. I can flip these things out of the way just like I flipped a portcullis. You know, exploring pirate filled caves what? wasn't really on my list of things to do today. Really? There's number two on mine right after getting trapped in a huge floaty bubble. Flipping was a non-transferable skill. Huh? Mm. I always get sneak points at Starbirds. One hundred percent flip. <laughs> Your turn, Patrick. It's away. I never knew there was a huge labyrinth of pirate-filled caves under Bikini Bottom. <laughs> Yeah, I know. Oh, that's so weird. Uh, what's a labyrinth? I planned that! Fry cook reporting. Ready to fire. I'm hungry. I wonder if anyone's ghost is pirate. 
of a sandwich. Careful, Bradley. You know what happened the last time one of your bread products became haunted. Cannon flipped and ready to fire. SpongeBob? Oh, we got separated again. Looks like I'll have to go on my own. Hmm. SpongeBob isn't here for me to throw across. Maybe I could throw that anchor instead. What? Oh, it's heavier than bubble bass. No good. If only there was something over there to throw this anchor onto. Time to go. Hey, uh, thing, and it looks like I can flip it with my spatula. What? Fine, be free. Wonder what they're remining down here. Maybe it was Kikorium! You know what would really lighten this place up? Some nice rugs. Or maybe some pottery lamps. Oh, and lava lamps! I wonder how far down these caverns go. Maybe in the center of the earth. Ah, that's not very realistic. Ooh, a ghostly pirate! Those floors look a bit rickety. Word were not approved. Mm -hmm. Look, another anchor! They're everywhere down here. Maybe this is the lair of the dread pirate anchor beard. Mine carts are great, but I'd love to ride around in one of those. Hey, you dummies! Patrick, ready! Okay. 
dirty wooden floors. Charming. I just love these things. These ghostly pirates aren't very subtle. I can see right through them. Looks like I'll have to call my trusty sidekick, Patrick! Doesn't look like the caves go down much further. Now this must be the lowest level. We're nearly at the end of our journey. Onward! Valuable. Maybe we should take it along. Consider it flip. My brain needed a rest anyway. What's this thing? I guess I better hold on to it. Ready, Mr. Cannon? Ooh. This throwing is making me dizzy. It's away! Buddy, I'll find a way to get you through. Another 
another one of those shiny things. I'll add it to the collection. This cannon should help you get through, Patrick old pal. Have a great time, Patrick! It appears that these shiny things will form a larger object. Most interesting. Look out below! And or ahead! Patrick, those shiny things we've been collecting have combined to make... A big shiny thing! What? Maybe I should wash my hands now. Ooh, what is this, SpongeBob? Some kind of amulet. Looks really old. I don't know, buddy, but it's got something written on it. It says... Antis. Antis. That must be Square Pantis. This must belong to your ancient ancestors! Let's take it to the Bikini Bottom Museum! They'll know what it is. Yay, the museum! I should pack my shorts. Oh wait, I'm wearing them already. Let's go! Whoa! This has been a day of treasure! Now that Patrick and I have escaped the spooky caves with that mysterious amulet, we've taken it to the Bikini Bottom Museum to see if any of the brainy people there know what it is. But before all that, this is a chance for me to try out my brand new camera by photographing all the cool things in the museum. I need to take pictures of the glowing objects in each area to score points. The better the picture I take, the more points I get. There are also secret things to photograph for bonus points. Ooh, secrety. Also, I can throw stale Krabby Patties around if I need to. They can be used to move tourists out of the way, or to stop the museum guards from yelling at me. There's huge, and then there's huge! I'm 
wish I was famous for my own thing. Natural history must be your thing. Some more photographs. <laughs> Natural. Home sweet home. Stop! 
putting that one in my photo album. Hey, I'm sleepy. found the missing half of the Atlantean amulet? What's an Atlantean amulet? Legend says that when the two halves are joined, the path to Atlantis is open. excitement in the museum, it's time for a relaxing musical interlude. Wait for the notes to get to the right spot first. Don't hit them too soon. If you make too many mistakes or don't hit the notes, then the bus will run out of fuel before we reach Atlantis. After each one of us takes a turn, you'll be given a score by Mr. Krabs, who has kindly volunteered to act as judge. But he gets to keep any coins that fall down in back of the seats. Buzz, 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 Whoa, this is so amazing that I'm, 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 I'm totally amazed.
my dad? Atlantis, I salute you in song. I'm singing! Weird! I'm singing! Tasty! Ding dong! Ding dong! I'm singing! Tasty! I'm singing! Sweet music. <laughs> La -di da. Jump, jump, jump. No. Jump, jump! Genius! Come on! <laughs> Barnacles! Oh, yes! in recognition of your contribution to song. My turn, my turn, my turn! I'm Patrick, and... I don't know what to say. You have run out of some fuel. This level is all about the magical flying bus. Well, it was a magical flying bus, but now that we've crashed it into the gardens, it's more of a magical hopping bus, or maybe a magical smoking, spluttering, occasionally going blah, 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 bus. That's why we need to find and collect all the parts that fell off in the crash. Hopefully, no one will notice that we've wrecked the lawn. Anyway, a few garden gnomes or a nice shrubbery, and it'll be as good as new. Each part that we find will help repair the bus, so it will regain some of its old powers. But they're scattered all over the garden, so we're going to have to go exploring. Please commence bus resolution. Nice toolkit. The toolkit is ours. We obtained the pickle. Why, oh, why did I come with these chumps? Toolkit! Turret, searching for bus has target. The toolkit is ours. We must collect toolkits. Slow down, 
this is crazy driving. What happened? This place is way bigger than Bikini Bottom. Time is on our side. That's not toolkit. We'd better hot foot it out of here. Ah! Oh, yeah. Nice toolkit. Long to it. Success. Congratulations! The turret is targeted on you. Nice! Toolkit! Ring for the king. Hmm. We destroyed the king of Atlantis' topiary garden! Well, okay, nobody's home. Let's go, people. Back on the bus. Nothing to see here. Welcome. The king of Atlantis! In this level, there are three of us following the Lord Royal Highness. He's the leader of the Atlanteans, you know. Anyway, he's giving us a tour of the palace. But 
For some unspecified and probably completely ridiculous reason, there are hazards and traps everywhere. You have to help us avoid the hazards and pitfalls so we can finish the tour. As soon as you see a hazard on screen, you can go for it. Don't wait around. Do it as fast as you can. Keep at least one of us going all the way to the end of the section so we can see the sights and win. And there are five sections in total to complete. Welcome to Atlantis, my strange little friends. This garden is amazing. It's like a photosynthetic wonderland. Follow me, there is much to see. This must be Atlantis Gardentis. Edible. This place makes me feel a little bold yet understated. It's like the biggest number I know. Oh, it's you guys. When do we get to see some Atlantean art? Hey, where's Mr. Krabs going? Looks like he found the treasure room. We won't see him for a while, or hopefully ever again. This place is like a Mr. Krabs magnet. Wow! It's almost like Atlantis is some kind of secret underwater city! I can pick a 
take that diamond and propose to myself. So we can exchange this gold for food, right? I wonder, do we get to take a gem home as a free gift? This way to the art room, gentlemen. Oh, at last, some culture. See you, losers. Hey there, boys. What you doing? Sandy, we're on the King's tour. Great, a royal tour. Does this mean I can be her royal squirrelness, Sandy Cheeks the First? Onwards, my strange little visitors. Sure do like their art. What flavor are these paintings? license. And now, here is the science room. Hee haw! I'll see you later, boys. Huh, it'll take more than a few fancy machines to distract me from this incredible tour. that's very alone is your one brain cell. Squidward, you came back for me. I wonder if they could have 
that's a new jellyfishing net for me. Skull. Well, the idea is appealing. Good luck with the bubbles, Bob. Bob. We've had enough of this tour. Howdy! Ooh, is this the bubbles now? Is it? That's right, Patrick. At the end of this corridor lie our dreams. The world's oddest bubble! Oldest, not oddest. Oh, well, now I'm disappointed. Okay. 
I saw, I bubbled. You must guess the password to prove you are worthy of seeing the oldest bubble ever. Congratulations! Hey, there you are. Our tour is almost over. Did I miss the bubbles? Sure did, Patrick. And those bubbles are tougher than they look. This must be the Bronze Bubble Award. Mr. Krabs has found the Atlantean treasure room, and the Lord Royal Highness has told him he can take as much as he likes. Naturally, Mr. Krabs doesn't want to insult the Atlanteans by refusing their generosity, so he's decided to take some treasure home. While Mr. Krabs is busy swimming around in all the treasure, Sandy is going to help him collect it with her brand new invention, the Bubble Collector 2000. I don't know why she doesn't use a net, but anyway. You need to help Sandy by pointing the bubble at the treasure and then grabbing it to score points. Can you get enough points before time runs out? Howdy there, Atlantean treasure! Yeah, I'm coming with me! This treasure is great and all, but it's not as nice as a sunset in Texas. Oh, <laughs> 
Squidward a nice guy? Now that we've found the Atlantean Hall of Art, he's given the artists the honor of painting him as he poses. He said something about finally meeting some people with class. I don't know what he means by that. Patrick and I have plenty of class, right, Patrick? Patrick, get your head out of there. You don't know where it's been. You must help Squidward strike the correct pose for the artists. Do them as quickly as you can, but don't make any mistakes. The Squidward School of Art is open. Another successful pose. Breathtaking. Has there ever been a more perfect view? William should see me now. And a more perfect view. Another perfect picture. Another successful pose. Inspiring. Encore. Inspiring. This is easier than I thought. I can do this all day. Inspiring. Breathtaking. Trey Artistique. Remarkable. I knew it. I'm the muse you've always wanted.
I knew it. I'm the muse you've always wanted. Now it's Patrick's turn to get behind the camera. We need some souvenir photographs of our time in Atlantis to show the people back home. Look for the glowing objects and be sure to photograph them. It's always worth taking a picture of anything else that looks interesting too. You never know what secrets there are in the museum. Keep an eye out for the Atlantean guards though. They don't like people using flash photography for some reason. Hey, I could use the photos to make a slideshow of my trip to Atlantis and take it to boating school. Mrs. Puff loves my impromptu slide presentations. They always bring tears of joy to her eyes. The museum is free to tourists. Please come in. I don't want to pull. That instrument is all stringy. Forsooth, twould appear I am utterly spent in ye patty. I didn't know sirens had maracas. Patrick Star, photographer. <laughs> Got it rhymes. The museum is always open. Siren Karaoke! I better restock on patties! Better get some more patties! Ooh. Remember that the cameras are forbidden in the museum. The museum is always open! Uh-oh! Out of patties! That instrument is all stringy. No more patties! Ocean, uh... Ocean, uh... Ocean... A post, but that is pretty darn fabulous. Oh, SpongeBob's gonna love that one. Well, shake my tambourine, will you look at that? Great photographs, Patrick. Look at that! I was born to photograph! Ugh. The museum is always open! Enjoy your visit. I'm out of 
Patty ammo. One, two, one, two, one, two. Whose turn is it to make the coffin? I was born to photograph. Listen to the question and throw a patty at the correct answer. If a tree bears fruit in winter, then who comes from Texas? Sandy. You are wise. Do not interfere with the brain of Atlantis. For soup. Watch out for those guys, Batman. Answer. If you take five dugongs away from three manatees, then who is green in color? Plankton. Affirmative. Can't wait to photograph that really old bubble. This corridor is constipated. by tossing a patty at one of the three choices. If it takes three fish nine days to dig a hole, then who was a sailor in the Navy? Crabs. Correct. Puffin' clams, I'm good. Behold the knowledge machine, the brain of Atlantis. Good day. Please ask any question. I have all the answers. The Museum of Atlantis will be hosting this year's brainwave competition. What's the difference between a tourist and an invasion force? An invasion force is more honest. Only if you start flossing. Hey! Single file, everyone! Single file! Welcome. Please refrain from taking flash photos. I don't want to boast, but that is pretty darn fabulous. Oh, Patrick Star, photographer. <laughs> Got it rhymes. I am the world's greatest photographer. These Atlanteans sure are weird, in a good way. So this is an Orwelli, an Orwelli. Planet Whirly thing. Great photo. A visit to our museum is a journey inside history. No 
more baddies! More baddies! More baddies! Baddies, where are you? Please, do not interfere with the large drain in the jar. Kind of a famous photographer. Fish. Lighten up. I bet I can pick it up. Go along. Oh, there's nothing to see here. Now that's slick. Did you guys get a move on? I'm out of patty ammo. A titanium bubble lined with a tungsten. Strontium and thallium shell, if I'm not mistaken. Sticky, sticky. That's one for the album. I've seen better. I don't get it. SpongeBob's gonna love that one. I am the world's greatest. Photographer. Did you guys get a move on? Commence visual enjoyment. Baddies, where are you? More baddies, more baddies! Position. You numbskulls! Everyone knows that wasn't the real bubble. It's just a prop for stupid tourists. This is the real deal. Ooh. Summon the Atlantean Royal Guard.
We've popped the Atlanteans' oldest living bubble. Now we're in trouble. All right, here's the plan. Stay here and blubber like a baby! No, that won't work. Escape through the palace! We'll need to use Patrick's strength, Sandy's lasso, Squidward's tentacles, and Mr. Krabs' pockets. I was going to offer my unfeasibly square pants to help, but apparently my spatula skills are more useful. Guide the characters around and use their abilities whenever a prompt appears on the screen. The instructions on how to use each power always appear at the top of the screen. Don't forget, you can switch between characters, too! Just look at this place, Sandy. It'll need both of us to figure a way out. I think it'll take both of us to escape this castle. Lasso! SpongeBob SquarePants and Sandy Cheeks. What a team! I need to flip this. Ooh, I threw that one good. I'm ready for action. Here I go. I'm gonna lasso open some walkways. Perfect. My turn. That is it. Switcheroo. Uh oh. TV tonight. I wish I knew what I was doing here. Time to turn on the lights. I'm ready for action. We should turn up the lights. Lasso! Those tourists obviously getting a promotion? Cut the jibber jabber. Better see if there's anyone here. Have you ever asked the king about that smell? When duty calls, it calls loud. Okay. 
make it a lot. Oh, Squidward, we've got to escape! Right, I get stuck with bubble brains here. Your turn! Mm -hmm. I'm like the strong one! Mm -hmm. My extra pair of tentacles might just come in handy here. This is a joke, right? What we need here is someone with four tentacles. That would be me. See another bubble, I'll be the one going pop. What happened? I'm going nowhere. I don't believe this, Patrick, but we're going to have to work together. Here I go again. Your turn. These Atlanteans need to get some bubble therapy. I need a foot massage. Patrick, 
think we need to get out of here. This is all because I'm an outlaw bubble popper.
This place looks tricky. It's just me, some science, and a brain cell called Patrick. I need a foot massage. Is this a room or an equation? I can smell kelp flavored ice cream. I feel so alive! Heat! Wow! I feel like I'm inside a brain. Squidward, I want you to know the science isn't my strong point. Patrick, keep up! What happens now? Chuckaroo! Better see if there's anyone here. I feel so alive! There's something you're not telling me. I'm not saying. Let's take a look around. Why, oh why, oh why? We never see any action. Huh? Woo is it me, or is this place really weird? This place is stupid. Ride the lightning! What just happened? We better avoid annoying any scientists. Yar! No one ever opens doors for me. Hey! Any minute now, things are gonna go wrong. Better see if there's anyone here. Stop that! What happened? There's something you're not telling me. This room makes me feel all complicated. Here's what I think. I'm feeling hungry. Patrick, keep out of the way of any experiments. You're strange enough. Why? Let's take a look around. When I get home, I'm moving back to Squidville. We never see any action. Damn. We should be very, very quiet. Here's what I do. Sea cucumbers, polyps, and noodles. I didn't see anything. My turn. Lights on time. I quit. Those tourists obviously didn't. Uh oh. We should turn up the lights. Oh, my eyes. My three hearts are pumping. Have room service. Hey, are you upset? Are you asking me? We should check out this area. Heads up! Heave! Woo! All the science and stuff is going to get heavy. anything
Well, Mr. Krabs, I don't think we want to upset anyone in here. I can't do this alone. Your turn! My turn! Mr. Krabs, I just want you to know, it was a privilege to flip your patties. I just know I'll see my pineapple again soon. I can't wait to be flipping patties again. Your turn! Now to get those weapons! Ow! Trapped! Now it's Plankton's turn in the spotlight. Although since he's trying to sneak into Atlantis undetected, he'll be trying to avoid all the spotlights he can. Ah! 
Plankton has to make his way through three areas to reach the Atlanteans' forgotten Mega Zappy weapons. Help Plankton make the right actions to avoid the Atlantean security devices and defenses. Don't make the actions too soon or get them wrong, because that will raise the alarm level. And if it gets too high, it's all over. Time to execute a plan that is not only needlessly elaborate, but also unnecessarily convoluted. Yes, being evil is the most fun a single-celled invertebrate can have. Ah, sweet, sweet world domination. Ha-ha! <laughs> You're no match for my evil genius. Just a small cog in the machine of my victory. Yes, sir, I am smooth. Mmm, minty. This is really exhausting. <laughs> my funniest joke yet, and no one to hear it. It's nearly time to crush my enemies like the vermin they are. Ouch! Newsflash for the citizens of Atlantis. Your new ruler is on his way. <laughs> Your new ruler, Plankton! Some of these knickknacks wouldn't have looked out of place in the Jumporium. Maybe I should add kelp to the Chum Bucket's menu. No time to stop and stare at the scenery, Plankton. You have nefarious schemes and evil plans to execute. I hate to burst your bubble, but you're no match for Sheldon J. Plankton. This have happened. I could really use some of SpongeBob's karate right about now. Ha! That was a walk in the park. way to my inevitable conquest of all Atlantis. Such a simple device cannot contain my genius. For a supposedly advanced society, I don't see many weapons of awesome destruction here. That looked 
dangerous. I like it. Their puny security is no match for Sheldon J. Plankton. These weak-minded fools don't stand a chance. Just you wait, Krabs. I'm coming for you and your accursed formula. Acceptable. Are you ready for some rootin' tootin' squirrel-based mayhem? Sandy's taking charge, and she's going to get us out of this palace if she has to zap every single guard in her way. Actually, I think she's loving all the action. Must be a squirrel thing. Anyway, she's using Squidward as a weapon, don't ask, to defeat the guards. So just point and zap. Don't forget to reload whenever you get a chance. A Texan scientist karate chopping squirrel is always ready for action. Why did I volunteer? Your octopus is no match for us! Go to the 
main gates. This is so undignified. We 
We need to get to the cat to fight for them.
And so that's how we got here. I know, Patrick, I was there. Here we go! Plankton's got a hold of his Atlantean super mega really, really big tank, and he's on a rampage! This is where we came into our adventure all those levels ago, so let's find out how it ends. All you've got to do is help Plankton make it to the next area, but the Atlantean defense forces would like to stop him and will need to be bombarded with ice cream. In fact, just blast everything with ice cream. That's pretty much the idea of this level. Don't forget, the tank's shields will recharge if you don't get hit for a few seconds, so running away works. I just love the red. Secret formulas I desire. I'm 
Come on, take it to the bridge. Time for some redecorating.
redecorating.
decision over. Talking spec will make an excellent replacement for our recently deflated national treasure. So long, and thanks for the tour. of this quickly. I might just get promoted if I throw this thing away. Thank <laughs> you. 
Is that all you've got? Gee whiz, he's in a hurry. I'm one tough guard. to the Seahorse Brigade now. Everyone, welcome to the Swap Bob Spareface screen. I am the most fashionable sponge in all the sea.
everyone. Welcome to the Swap Mob's Fairface screen. You know, I think I could set a new fashion trend looking like this. Subtle, yet understated. <laughs> 